Right then, let's get started. Uh, you've probably found this video if you're having problems mounting PC Engine Super CD games. Uh, you've downloaded your Super CD games. They come in a in a zip file or a raw file or whatever. You extract it, and you usually get two files like this. You get an ISO file and a Q file and sometimes they come like this as well when you extract it like all these audio files like that so let's get started uh, you need a, a mounting tool uh, as well that supports uh, SCSI or SCSI a SCSI drive uh, Uh, I'm using Demon Tools Ultra. So basically, in this tool, I right click, right mouse click here, add images. I'm gonna do Rondo, Rondo of Blood. This is the English translated version, and you see here, it's the Q file that we want. So I'll click that and open that. I'm going to do uh, four more, uh, three more, because I'm using the Magic Engine emulator and uh, that supports, well, it doesn't support, it shows four mounts. If you mount four games, it shows four mounts in the emulator. It doesn't show any more than four though. So. I'm gonna add. I'm gonna add the Q file of Bomberman ninety four. I'm gonna add Gate of Thunder Q. I'm gonna add. Let's do Winds of Thunder as well. So once they've loaded up in here. I'm going to right mouse click advanced mount and this is what I mean here you, you need a, a virtual drive of a SCSI drive or SCSI drive uh, people pronounce it differently uh, I'm going to choose my drive letter I'm going to choose G I'm going to mount that I'm going to mount the rest using a different drive letter Different drive letter mount. Different drive letter. Right, once we've got those mounted, we can open as emulator. By the way, that thing before where I ran my emulator from that that isn't the emulator. That's like a front end. So to boot CD uh, I set mine to auto so it automatically picks the system card for whatever game you're running so and then you just left click whatever game you want Vor langer Zeit lebten die Menschen glücklich und zufrieden. Niemand bemerkte den Schatten, der sich langsam über ihnen ausbreitete. As much as I love that intro, uh, I gotta stop it. <laughs> Bomberman, 
I better stop that before I get into it. I love that game, by the way. Gate of Thunder. I like Gate of Thunder. I like Gate of Thunder better than I do Winds of Thunder, but I still like Winds of Thunder as well. So that's how you do it. It's quite simple, really. But there's not there's not that much information on internet about how to do it. Like I never knew uh, that it needed to be a SCSI drive, mounted as a SCSI drive. I looked on YouTube and I was just finding foreign videos that I couldn't understand, so I had to figure it out myself. So I hope this turns out to be helpful for anybody else that wants to run them on your PC emulation. Bye.